You've probably heard about AI art generators, where the user can generate an artistic image just by inputting a prompt. Recently, I noticed a lot of artists protesting against AI-generated artworks, but personally, I am not worried about the development of AI-generated images replacing human artists. And the only thing I dislike about AI artwork is the model copyright issues surrounding the AI's data input when generating these images. Let me explain. One thing that makes artists worried is how quickly and detailed these computer-generated images can be. And the product is much less costly than hiring a human artist to create these illustrations. One such example is how game developers are starting to use AI-generated artworks for their art instead of hiring artists. I understand how this devastates working artists like myself due to the potential of losing our jobs as they are being taken over by artificial intelligence. But here's the catch. In order to predict the direction of the development of AI art, we first need to understand the working mechanism of these technologies. Artificial intelligence consists of a neural network which utilizes a database of many images. They analyze their visual elements through machine learning technologies and use them to generate new ones. This is where the issue with copyright comes in. As many of the artworks used in these machine learning databases are copyrighted works of other artists, oftentimes without their permission. However, this algorithm for creating art isn't too different from humans. Let me explain. A quote by Dr. Prem Jagyasi states, Creativity isn't finding something new. It is rearranging what you already know into a new mold. Neurologically, I agree with this statement. Just try to come up with a color that you've never seen before. Couldn't do it? This is because your brain has never perceived such color, thus this color cannot be rendered in your brain. The same is with art. Throughout history, all of the artworks created by humans are based on something that the person had perceived. So the images that the artists have created are always based on informational inputs from the visual senses of the artists. However, this does not excuse the copyright issues regarding artworks used in AI databases, as the artworks created by human artists consist of a much more vast amount of conceptual information being intently rearranged to create an image. While the AI uses far less informational inputs, all of which are extremely specific to the product from the ideas of the human artists. This ratio is hardly comparable. The informational input ratios between humans and AI cannot be compared. It's like comparing the volume of one grain of rice to the total volume of the sun. This discrepancy of the ratio is why I believe there to be an issue with copyright when it comes to these AI-generated images. The informational input of the artists are from the continuous experiences of the human, which is something that the current AI cannot compete with. Another point I like to make is the limits on the AI's abilities when it comes to generating these images. Initially, I was very impressed by how detailed and beautiful many of the AI-generated artworks are, however, I would not call them real art. They lack the substance that human-made artworks have, such as the meaning behind the visual elements and the intent behind the rearrangement of these elements to generate these images, therefore the AI-generated artworks are not artworks. They're just pictures that look pretty. I've tested many AI art generators and none of them can generate exactly what I had in mind. No matter how detailed and specific the prompt I inputted was, none of the resulting images were even close to what I had pictured in my head. The sense that the AI art generators do not allow true and full artistic expression. So, good luck to those people who hire an AI artist to create something specific. It is unlikely that they'll ever get the exact result that they want. Well, Although the images generated by AI looks appealing at first, but the more I look, the more redundant these images become. It just feels like I'm looking through the same pattern over and over and over again without anything truly added to the mix. What do you mean by the same pattern? None of these pictures look the same. I'm not talking about the visual elements. I'm talking about how the images appear to be formed and constructed. There's a pattern to how this AI rearranges and composes these images, and over time your brain really picks up on it. 
Now when I scroll through the internet looking for art, I can immediately tell which ones are AI generated and it is just tedious to look at it. It is extremely difficult for the current machine learning technology to branch out from its preset image generating algorithms which highly limits the AI's abilities when it comes to creativity. However, this is not a limit of our organic-based processors, which is another reason why we should not worry too much about AI replacing human artists. These are just some of my perspectives when it comes to AI-generated artworks and how you should not worry too much about them replacing our jobs. But anyways, thank you guys so much for watching all the way through this video. I'm Cindy Lee Art, and please kindly like and subscribe if you are curious to see more. And have a good one.